Hey little Pokemon fans out there and welcome back to my weekly Pokemon news where I discuss and inform you all on the world of Pokemon. Today guys we have a shitload of news to get through today so buckle up, get in, get some water because it's gonna be a crazy one. Let's get right into it. Niantic, the creators of Pokemon Go is cracking down on cheaters. They're putting a band hammer down on those who jailbreak their phones. That's right, Niantic is cracking down on people that jailbreak their phones. Pokemon Go, the app, will now scan your phone without your permission. Pokemon Go will not open if they detect those folders. One of the folders that is known is Magic's is Magix Manager, which is a popular software tool used for jailbreaking. So if you use that, do not use Pokemon Go guys, do not use Pokemon Go. So that is a little hashtag cray, I won't lie, that is a little insane to, for them to do that, Niantic to do that, but like, I get it. They're a business, they want to make money, well, well, more money, but let's be honest, it's not going to stop jailbreakers. There's always a new software, there's always new hackers, there's always new ways to go around a system. Latias and Latios will now be distributed through Pokemon Sun and Moon and Ultra Sun and Moon over the Nintendo Network for Europe and Australia. Australia! Starting from September 1st all the way to 23rd of September, you can get your Latias and Lotias depending on the game you have. Pokemon fans rejoice, there is a huge marathon about to be held on Twitch that will stream all the series, all 932 episodes of Pokemon all on Twitch and the movies as well. How crazy is that? Each week, the marathon will stream 10 to 16 episodes from Monday to Thursday, throwing in some reruns on the Friday to Saturday, and on Sunday is all for the movies. So that is insane. That is so cool, actually. But that's not it. Viewers can earn badges for how long they watch the stream for. That, that's so cool. So if you watch for 10 hours, you can get so many badges. The more badges you have, the higher you appear on the leaderboards. How crazy is that? How cool is that for Pokemon to do that? It's so interactive. The Pokemon community is going to go nuts. I can see it. It's going to be so cool. Just all this Pokemon fans that like the anime, that like the movies, that like the everything all in the one. It's going to be so cool. All right, guys. Now on to the TCG side of the Pokemon news. We have a new image for Dragon Majesty Super Premium Collection Box. There's nothing new to discuss here, it's just a new image detailing what you can get into it. As opposed to my last video I did, it was just a very basic photo, but this one's more detailed. I will put it up on screen for you lads. Looks so nice, super keen. I really want those Dragonite and Kingdra, obviously. They look so hype, so keen. New promos for Japanese gym tournaments. Cards have been revealed and boy, they look insane. You can get an Alolan version of Marowak. Alolan Marowak and the artwork is absolute fire. Excuse the pun. But sadly, it's only exclusive to Japan, but hopefully it will make its way over to us, Australia and America. That would be really nice because I really want that Alolan version of Marowak because it looks so dope. When translated to English, it reads, Ability. Cursed Body. If this Pokemon is your active Pokemon and is damaged by an opponent's attack, the attacking Pokemon is now confused. The attacks. Heat Bone. 90 damage. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now burned. Lost Boomerang GX. This attack does 50 damage to two of your Pokemon to two of your opponent's Pokemon. If a Pokemon is knocked out by the damage from this attack, put that Pokemon and all the cards attached into the opponent's lost zone. So, not too sure how viable this card, but it sounds pretty broken to me. I'm not too familiar with the rules. I'm not too familiar with the rules, but it looks pretty good. Looks pretty broken to me. Leave me your thoughts below if you guys play the TCG game. I'd love to hear them. But that's not it guys, that's not it. Sun and Moon 8, Explosive Impact, the next set to be released in Japan. The set has now been revealed with English translations to go with the cards. And boy, oh boy, we have some goodies to get through in this set. Let's get into it. Suicune is finally getting some GX love. It's about time Suicune is getting some love. Oh, the artwork looks so good. I will pop it up on screen here or there. It looks so good. And we have the English translations. When it translated to English, it reads Ability Phantom Wind. Once during your attack, before your attack, 
If this Pokemon is on your bench, you may shuffle this Pokemon and all their cards attached to it into your deck. The attacks. Pure Stream, 120 damage. During your opponent's next turn, the defending Pokemon's attacks do less damage. Brinsicle GX. Please forgive me if I pronounce that wrong, but I think it's Brinsicle. I think that's how you pronounce it. The damage, 150 damage, boys. That's a lot of damage. Which this Pokemon with one of your bench Pokemon. But wait, there is more. Pyranitar GX, Shuckle GX, Selby, Prism Star, and Lusamine, the crazy mom. Prism Star, all common in this set, and the artwork is absolute fire. It is absolutely insane. Really want all of those cards that I just said. I bought two boxes. I already pre ordered two boxes of Explosive Impact. It's gonna open up on my channel. Love for you guys to watch it. Hit that sub so you don't miss out. So you don't miss out. They're all here. Cue the Smash Bros. They're all here, meme. We have the English translations for all the cards, like I said earlier. I won't read it out loud for you guys because there is a lot to go through, so I'll just pop it up on screen for you guys. Please pause if you want a detailed uh, look on the cards. What cards are you guys looking forward to? Love to hear your thoughts. Let me know below and I will reply. I always reply to the comments. That is not it. That is not it. There is more news, guys. I told you there is a fuckload of news to get through. Pokemon has released a new image for a new type of card that's coming to Sun and Moon. I believe it's coming to Sun and Moon at the end of the year. The artwork looks super insane. It is a tag team of Zekrom and Pikachu. The tax, the HP is insane. Is insane. 150 damage, 200 damage for the GX attack, I believe. It's nuts. Is that broken for the TCG game? I'm not too sure how viable it is in the game, but like, it looks broken. 150 damage? Come on. I'm sure that that's going to be a banned card in no time for the for the game. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and got informed. If you did, hit that like button. That'd be really appreciated. Hit that sub button to stay notified if you like what I'm all about. You don't have to, but if you like what I'm all about and you want to get up to date, and if you want to stay up to date with all the news in Pokemon, I will be sure to report it. Anyways guys, thanks again for watching and have yourselves a great day.